There's a lot of things to say about Brendan Schaub, but we're going to focus on him being a hater today because his associate producer, Chin, talks about the Hakua girl and her new line of merch that's exploding. So here it is, Brian Callen and Brendan Schaub having a look at the Hakua's merchandise because we know Brendan loves merch, merch that doesn't sell, and Papa also likes to steal logos. Let's check out what the hater has to say. All right. Next one, the Hawk Tua girl. We just talked about her on Monday. So she's doing products now, merch. And I guess she's making a lot of money. Really? Yeah. I mean, it just started, and I saw some of the merch. So one of them are these hats. Good for her. <laughs> well, not the most creative, but mm -hmm. whatever. Oh, Brendan, you're the biggest hater, aren't you, Bubba? And why is this? What, because your eight centimeters is too small for a hot to up spit on that denim vagina? I think Brendan's extra salty because Joe Rogan is a huge fan of hers. The term hater gets thrown around way too liberally. Being critical of a specific person doesn't make you a hater. However, this dude, Bubba, is the very definition of a hater. He hates on everyone. Schaub hates on fighters, hates on organizers organizations, hates on athletes, hates on other comedians, hates on his co-host, hates on his kids, hates on other parents' kids, hates on other parents, hates on people who can lift more than him. You can tell Brendan's jealous of Hatua Girl's success in every facet. This dude's been trying to go viral for years, even flipped a truck. Not to mention, it has to drive Brendan nuts that she went viral effortlessly by just being herself and having fun saying something off the cuff like that. Meanwhile, Brendan has to have a whole marketing team and try so hard just to instantly be forgotten. And like I mentioned before, his truck flip got attention for like one and a half days before it got lost in the shuffle. Schaub's video got more views on other people's channels than his own. And if you watch the full video with her, she's not even paying attention to the guy with the camera and keeps walking off. She only answered the question she's now famous for because her friend grabbed her and told her to answer it. The fact she wasn't even trying and didn't care about the camera yet went viral while Brendan Schaub is blowing his dad's retirement money, trying his best to go viral. For just the day is perfect. And did you guys notice in this video clip Brendan Schaub's fake yawn as soon as her name is brought up? The only way Schaub will ever go viral will be from leaked police body cam footage after he does something really bad. Has Bapa ever considered consider not being a hater for like two seconds. But I thought he was such a nice guy. Some would say the nicest. All team nice guy here. And just imagine having this moron criticize your merch because it's not creative. Now that's hilarious. He's the least self-aware person in existence. It's unreal. The Hoktua girl should hire Brendan's design team. She should use Bean Dip's savvy move of using samples sent in by graphic artists without acknowledging or paying them. He's the best brains, you know. That's what you get for using Fiverr, Papa. And this chick is more popular in the last three weeks than Brendan Schaub's ever been in his entire career. Schaub is so salty and jealous right now. He should rebrand to Soy Boys R Us. Anyhow, let me know what y'all think in the comment section down below because that's what truly matters even though we don't matter. But hey, do me a huge favor. Hit that like and subscribe on your way out. I'd appreciate that. Thanks for watching all the videos. Also, push the notification bell so you know when new videos come out. Otherwise, I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Like, but the Bal Bal Balenciaga one. Jesus Christ.